Welcome back. Chapter 2, level 2. It's 1 in the morning. I have work tomorrow, but I don't have to go until 1, so at this rate, I need to fall asleep in like 3 hours to get to work. With enough energy to get through work. So, we're good to go. Chapter 2, level 2, underground caves. Let's get the intro. Wait, wait, because I actually. He is becoming level. stronger with every step he takes. His prowess in battle is undeniable. He will need it now. Goblins are one thing, but there are other creatures in the dark places of the world. Creatures who know nothing of his plight, but fight for their very survival. Many fallen brothers are testament to this. Indeed, their bleached bones adorn the tortuous tunnels in this godforsaken place. He runs ever onward into peril. I wonder who the prey is, and who is the hunted. Perhaps when the time comes, these creatures will know fear as they look into the eye of their quarry. Go, my friend, save your love. Save my love, awesome. Got it. So I jumped down that big tree at the end of the last level. Um, and now I'm in what looks like a very leafy ground area. It always seems like you're moving very fast. Oh, yeah. I'm actually surprised I didn't do it this time. Every time I play through this game, when I get to this part, I think I have to jump across there and I always like fall through and die. No, 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 not down. Back! Not down. Oh, I, did. I, I was holding down, that's why. My bad. Okay, that is the game. If it controls me, the dark side is you have to hold back and jump, and that's what I'm used to. Look at you, pretty! Hello! Those sweaters have eight eyes instead of six. Or no, eight legs, six eyes. Whatever. Oh yeah, now you're just now hearing this behind you? Dummy. Get this mother off! So daggers are a little bit effective against it. Uh, okay. What do we have? 22, 40 experience points. Let's go over here. Let's do this.
so if you got poison, but to take poison, you just have to activate your light magic. Which I think drains a lot of One thing I did wish that they had in this game was like somewhere to like point you in the right direction because you can get lost pretty easily if you don't know where you're going. Like I'll probably end up getting lost at least one time in this game. on ones aren't bad, but the ones you have to go like side to side and you can't tell where you're going. I found a scroll. Always has a green glint to it. Although they are big, spiders are surprisingly quick and agile. I've heard a skilled warrior may even tame one to a certain degree if it tires enough and ride it like a warthog. I have also heard that their webs can be used to weave bridges strong enough to bear the weight of a grown man. Incredible. Perhaps I'm losing my wits stuck in this infernal place. I must be crazy to believe such a thing. But you're not. You're, you are dead to me now, so. Sorry. Like these ones are like really hard because you can't really tell. See, and then you have to pull right to the trigger. Freaking hard, I'm telling you. Oh yeah, need to upgrade your combat cross in order to saw through this totem come back when your skills on free. I do wish that they had a map though too, so you can tell like which areas you've discovered and what you have yet. That big ass skeleton in the back. Find a way to blow up this barrier. said before they regenerate over time those green statues. Oh, are you stuck? No. Why am I why why is this a glitch? Okay there oh, man, I was about to be ticked if I had to restart everything. Alright, here we go. Got a travel scroll. Yeah, everywhere I turn there is death and decay. God has deserted us. Again, with the guy that has the surging, I mean, I know it's a hard time, but come on. I've abandoned my quest. It is hopeless. I don't want to die. To end up like my all, to end up like all my fellow brothers fallen by the wayside, destined to be a resource for some other adventure. I don't want that to be my fate. 
Oh well. Hope I compensated the one direction, my bad. I know it doesn't really say, I just, I, I know from experience that that's the other one. They not have a little green tint to them. Like, watch the next time, or go back and rewatch it. I swear, there's a little bit of green in it, so it tricks me. I think I'm getting a life gem. I've been following the trail of Ronaldo Gandolfi, who is do the combat cross upgrader, famed alchemist, and fellow of fellow of the Brotherhood of Light. Yeah. I don't know what drove him to leave the order, or indeed why he disappeared into the wilderness. But we could certainly use his skills. In this dark time, that's for sure. It is said he created many magical weapons and relics, and that he hides them in hard to find places where only the most committed and deserving to stumble upon them. Like in the middle of a church that you have to go through to go through the game. Mm -hmm. so back down this way, I guess. I think one of the first times I played this game, I was just going in circles over there for the longest time. Because it was, that's that's the pathway, if you don't recognize this, we came through here earlier. And, it, like, if you go backwards instead of, like, forwards on that, then you can, like, end up in the same spot where the room keys are without getting the second room key. The room key. stone key. can't speed crawl along a wall, so I'm sorry if those parts take a little bit longer. I wish you could like in Dark Siders. Like in Dark Siders. Oh, and then the one time I just, I fell back down without getting the stone key, so I had to go all the way back around. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Maybe I didn't go in circles. But man, it was funny. I was there. You kidding me? It's right there. <laughs> Stone keys are in place. Open says a meat. Oh, hard to reach places. Another upgrade.
Chain, yes. Can be used to saw through obstacles and to tame dangerous monsters by looping it around their necks. Cool. So I have the chain, or the spiked chain, instead of a regular chain. So there was a place back in that level that I can use the spiked chain to, it was one of these things. <laughs> right there is supposed to saw through the entire thing. <laughs> da -da -da! I missed the magic gem. I was probably behind the other statue. Oh well. We, can come back again. we did get the spike chain and new artwork unlocked. So that was the underground caves. Only a 16% on that one. Oh, it's just pathetic. Anyway, next one's called the labyrinth entrance. We'll get that one next time. Um, I hate asking, yeah, I hate saying it every video, you know, like, comment, subscribe, all that, follow everything. It's whatever. If you guys like watching these, I trust that you'll do that anyway. If you don't like watching these, then you don't have to watch them. It's not that big of a deal. I hate asking for it in every video. I might throw it in every once in a while, but it just sounds like too much begging to me, you know, you know at some point. Um, but yeah, so there's level two of chapter two. We have a spike chain now, um, a second upgrade to our whip. Yeah, it's getting good, man. I'm just, I'm, just, I love playing this game. I'm so excited to play this game. I hope you guys like watching the game because it's a fun game. And see you in the next one.